Hey guys, it's Blacksmith92, and we are in the Tekkit world, but as you can see, we're not at my base. I'm getting a little tired of building just uh, Tekkit stuff, and my base is actually getting a little bit laggy, so until I figure out what else I'm going to do there, I decided I wanted to go out, and I wanted to do something I did in Old World once, but of course I didn't record it. Uh, I'm going to build a reservoir with a dam, and then I'm just going to build a base around it, because I think that'd be a pretty cool thing to have, and I'll just clean this out, because these... As cool as they look, I don't want it to look like that. But anyways, uh, we're going to do a speed build for this, and I hope you enjoyed the video. So stay tuned, and let's see what happens.
All right, so we are done, sort of. <laughs> we got the uh, the dams done. So I think they look pretty cool. I, yeah, I like them. They look. I don't know how else to describe it. I like the way they look. I like the. Uh, this side doesn't really matter how they look because it'll be filled with water. And then this side just got a nice little touch, just so it's not just a sheer wall. So I think that looks pretty cool. Uh, eventually, what I plan to do is put a couple pistons in this side so that water can drop down and it'll flow into the river but that's gonna be it for this speed build so to recap what we've done we've got the, the dams done to hold back the water which really doesn't matter because minecraft water is really weird and not at all like the real world but i like him and it would be weird to have a reservoir without dams but we got also got uh, some cool underwater future thing which I don't know what I'm going to put in there, but I think it'll look cool and it'll look nice underwater, I'm sure. So in the next part of this speed build, because I'm going to break into two parts, I'm going to attempt to fill this with water, and we'll use a combination of things. We'll use ice, because it has an EMC value, and we'll use buckets of water, which I'll grab from my overclocker factory. And we'll see if we can fill this in with water. It'll be a little bit of a nightmare, but I think it'll be worth it and it'll be really cool. So hopefully you enjoyed the video and you want to stick with it and see the finished result. But for now, that's going to be it. And this is actually from the past. Not from me, but from whoever was here before me. So we'll just block this up because I don't want to see it. But anyways, uh, hopefully stick with me for the next part. And hopefully this works because I have no idea how hard it's going to be to fill this with water. But you'll see what my plan is in the next video. Uh, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed. Check out other ones on my channel if you liked it, and subscribe if you want. And that's going to be it, so see y'all later.